Hi, today we will see multiple selected drop down in PHP and also we will get a data of selected items in PHP. So for that we need a form and form should be closed and form have some properties some attributes so attributes is a action so action is blank and its method is post then inside a form we need some uh, select text and select text should be closed and here is a some options and option close and this option is for choose your favorite language and choose option choose options and choose option and the second option is for choose your favorite programming language so my favorite programming language is laravel and its value is also laravel so let's copy and paste it sorry paste it here copy two more times for html and php this is for php let's put it here php as well and this is for html html and here also uh, html let's make it one more for better understanding let's put it css and here as well css um, yeah here css okay so if you want to send data laravel php html means if you want to select this options okay this will not send any data to a php because this is a html not a php so this will not send any data to a php because this select tag doesn't have any name attribute so let's make it name and you can give any name of this attribute i am giving length so let's run this application and see how it looks so let's put it localhost and your project name and my project name is php tutorial so as you can see here is a laravel let me zoom in so you can see clearly choose the option laravel php html and css but at this time we want uh, we want a multiple selection okay when we uh, when we select multiple it's not working okay you can press a control and you can press any key of your keyboard it's not working for multiple you can't uh, choose uh, more than one because this select take this option take it doesn't have an attribute which is multiple so let's put it multiple and bam Control S for save and refresh. Now you can choose multiples. Hold the control key of your keyboard and choose multiple. Select and select, select and unselect. Right? So we have a, a chosen multiple values from a select, uh, select multiple selection, but we want to send this data, Laravel and PHP, whatever selection selected data you want to send in a php for that we need to make a php code so let me write here php take like this and php take should be closed and here we will write a code for getting values of this options this multiple options so let's if check okay is set dollar underscore post and post what we want to set if okay because we doesn't have any submit button so input type submit and its name its value is uh, value submit submit and uh, its name is its name is submit so let's copy this name and put it here if submit bus button is set means it is set then we will go to further so now we will also check this select tag have a data or not it means you have a selected or not at least one 
and more so for that we need to check it is empty or not so if it's not empty not empty emp it's not empty means you have selected one and more than one it means multiple selection if it's not empty dollar underscore post and our post name and we are getting this data by this variable let's copy and paste it here but this will not work okay this will not work if you if you are working on multiple it will not work if you just simply copy this name and paste it here it will not work you will not get multiple values because this is a multiple values and it's a uh, its logic is based on array so just put it uh, this bracket this array bracket then it will work so don't forget to add this bracket yeah so now we need to uh, loop through and get all the uh, values so let's put it for each loop and copy this name because it's written in an array of data so we are extracting array and getting a data so this is a link dollar underscore post this is link and put us keyword with for each loop and our selection so dollar you can make any variable selected okay and then we sim simply we can echo this uh, this uh, selected data so let's put it echo and semicolon and save so let's save and run this application syntax error line number 22 i think we just forgot 20 um, yeah i think this is a bracket we didn't have closed save and ref save and refresh okay so now it's good so let's choose a laravel and php and then submit it says a laravel and php but we want to in a separate line so let's put it a br tag so as you can see let's put put uh, let's select html and php and submit as you can see php and html so this value you can store in your database and whatever uh, of your purpose to getting these values because this is very useful when you go in advance in php uh, it's really uh, uh, a nice thing uh, um, for making projects functionality so pretty much we have uh, done if you have any questions you can write a comment i'm here to help you and if you like please give a thumbs up so thanks for watching bye bye have a nice day